welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Ultimate Sim Challenge. We are here with our Sim, Kendalyn Savage herself. And you're probably going to notice that some things are different about her. And yes, there are. I've given her a different hairstyle. That's pretty much it. I looked at the clothes and I couldn't really pick anything that I really liked. Um, those are creepy eyes. But um, I did really, 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 really like this um, new hairstyle on her. So I thought I would go ahead and give it to her. Um, it is a custom content one, but like, that's okay. What is she doing? Oh. <clears throat> okay. So I think today is going to be the day we actually... Why is she transforming? Oh, it's a full moon. I think today is actually going to be the day that... Uh... Why is it so loud? Anyways... One hour until time to leave for home. Wrap up those last minute goodbyes. Yeah, I was just going to say, I think today's going to be the day that we're actually going to be heading home. So I do want to get her back to the house because um, I need her to grab the mail and stuff before she leaves. So. Can I actually, like... Okay, there is no mail. That's perfect. All right, but we're going to be coming back for another week, so I'm actually not going to um, pick up our stuff upstairs. We'll just wait and come back and pick it up. It's fine. You didn't actually need to sit in it. The only problem is she's going to be a werewolf when she travels, and that's going to mess with her voice. Um, I'll just have to fix her voice once, once, um, once we get back. She's aging up never. <laughs> okay. Seems a little bit odd, since she should be aging up at some point, someday. We might have a glitch, and that is not good. Um, my aging is on, right? Like, I'm going to go check, because now I'm kind of like, enable aging. Yeah, it's on. Okay. Just making sure. Um, let's see, is there anything we could do? Why don't you go ahead and ask for more donations, I guess. Since you didn't do it last time. <laughs> um, and... We could send a friendly text to someone. We could send it to... Man, we just like... Don't have anyone we're not like already friends with. Okay, so we've mastered social networking. We have four levels left on charisma, and the next thing we need to start working on is alchemy, is our other one. And we can do, um, well, we need to finish off our werewolf abilities. And then the other thing is we need to complete, um, we also can do the glass blowing. Is that what it is? Artesian skill. That's what it is. Man, I really couldn't think of that. Alright. Did she not ask for more donations? Because when I came in here, I seen it again. Oh no, she did. Okay. What is this? Travel home. Here we go. Unfortunately. Unfortunately, we, we have to do it in... um. In werewolf form. Alright, well, I'm gonna let Kendalyn travel back home and then I will pick up with her when she reaches there. So I will see you guys when we are arriving back in Sunset Valley. Alright, so we have arrived back and, um,. We're headed over to our house. And she ages up in 42 days. Okay, so that's perfect. So it isn't glitched perfectly. Okay, so... Once we get here, um, I am going to need to fix her voice. I don't think she's in werewolf form. But she is going to sound like a werewolf still. Which will be really annoying. So I'll fix that... I might even fix it when we get back to university. I don't know. We'll see. Um, and then I just need her to take 
an exam, the like exam thing. All right, go ahead and take the Sims University aptitude test. It's pretty cool to hear the writing. I was just thinking like, I don't think I've ever heard that before. Like them writing on that. I don't think I've ever heard that noise. Man, this is a long interaction. Okay, so we get six bonus or business credits. We are 307 of 400. So we're getting there. Um, but that's what we're going to be going for, and she gets no scholarships, unfortunately. Okay. So we've got the preparing for university. I am going to go ahead and, while we're here, go ahead and let her accept the gifts. Just because I'm going to save before we head back, so it would be perfect. All right, so this one is from HUDJ69. It says, I hope this gets this gets in a video heart it is totally in a video I hope that you see it and let me go ahead and take it here we just got a bottled vampires bite thank you so much these are actually gonna be great for her just because she's obviously at some point probably gonna either want to have to turn certain people or whatever so these will be great so thanks for the bottled Vampires bites for Kendallin in my ultimate ooh girl ultimate sim challenge ooh. LP. I've started thinking about telling you guys like what episode it is so that you guys know when it goes live that your your gift was in that episode. So I think I might start doing that at some point, but I don't know. We'll see. I'd have to know what exact episode we would be going into to be able to do that all the time. So I don't know. We'll see. Like I said. But, oh, I didn't copy that. But thank you so much for that. I really do appreciate it. The next one is from Izzy Wizzy Bear. It's the message from the game. I'm going to take it here. We just got a sleeping gnome McMulty. So thank you so much for that. And let me, oop, let me go ahead and send you back a gift as well. So thanks for the... Gnome for Kendallin in my, oop, I really can't frigging type with this brace on my wrist. Alright, I am going to copy this though. Alright, the next one is from Amy Lewis 397 is the message from the game and take it here. We just got a no snooze alarm clock. Thank you so much for that. And I will go ahead and send you back a gift as well. And put alarm clock. All right, moving on up. The next one, if there is one, if there is. Is from Peter82. It's a thanks for the blooming sunflower for Sid in my perfect genetics challenge. Hope you get something useful. All right, we got a guitar. Thank you so much. She's actually going to need that. So that'll be awesome. So thank you so much for that. And you're keeping uh, Kendallin going here. And I think she might even need that in the next town. I can't honestly remember. But nonetheless, thank you so much. Pizzazza Girl 1015 it says, Thank you for the vial of potent bliss for Bay in my going solo challenge. Please open this in any LP that you're currently playing in. All right, I'm going to go ahead and take it here. And we got an invigorating elixir. Thank you so much. And I think this is going to be my last of the day. So, let's see. Um, invigorating elixir. So thank you so much for that one. 
And then the last one is from Akina1977. It says, thanks for the football for Marcus and my Supernatural family. I'm sure he will use it a lot. You're so very welcome, and thank you for the art easel. Oh, my goodness. And I'm so sorry I can't send back to you. All right, so before we head on out, there is one thing I do want to go ahead and do. Um, is there anything that I need to get rid of? We have apples, so I'm just kind of thinking probably don't need to worry about that. We're obviously not going to live here when we get home. We're probably going to move to a different location. So why do we have all this stuff? This is not all mine. This is mine. Why do we have all this? Where do we get all this from? Is this from gifts? I'm going to sell this. We don't need it. Man, I don't know what all that's from, but okay. Some of that stuff is worth good money. So, All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and save, and then I'm going to have her head back to, to college. If I tell her to enroll in university, um... I'll show you what we're going to do. I'm obviously not going to do it because I'm going to go save first before we head back. But you hear her voice. It's really bad. Okay, so we're obviously going for business. We're going to go for one term because we don't need to go for anything more. And we're going to go for 12 credits. It's going to cost us 1000 250 simoleons we have 56,480 and then after that one week we will be done so that's what I'm going to go ahead and do right now but like I said I want to save quickly before we head back just in case you know because the sims 3 is pretty glitchy sometimes on the travels and um I will catch you guys when we're back in university be back in just a second all right so we are back and we're in university um, she wants to call Eddie, so I think I'm going to go ahead and just let her give him a good old call. So go ahead and chat with him on the phone. And I did go ahead and, um, I fixed her voice. <laughs> I think that's kind of close to what she had before. I can't ah, remember, though. Residine. Residine okay. Um, give him a friendly hug, eat something Can raw. You know? Meet a local. That's probably a lot easier than anything else. Alright. Go ahead and when you're done, get the mail. Uh, mm. What is this guy doing? <gasps> okay. Um, why is that so loud? Give him a friendly hug. Do I have like my sounds up or something? Because it's really loud for me. Uh, no, not really. It's where I always have it. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Odd. It is cold outside. It is actually winter now, which is kind of cool. So we have went through <laughs> summer, <laughs> fall, and spring. Or, <laughs> summer, fall, and now winter. Um, and I do want her to apply for extra funds. And she's got all of her stuff in here. She don't wag. You got her. Okay. <laughs> this is nuts. Um. Now she's back to never aging uh, up. <laughs> I think someone's having a party or something. Oh, she missed it. Okay. All right, so it looks like everyone has pretty much showed up now, and now that they're here, I can go ahead and lock this door to everyone but ourselves. So lock this to specify, okay, so it's specifying that Kendalyn is the only girl who can get in there, because that is going to be our bedroom again, obviously, because we bought the bed and stuff. Now, is there anyone here that we haven't met? Yeah, we need to do a charming introduction with her. We've got Jake here who we haven't met. She's kind of cute. She really is. Have you met Walt, um, Garrison, I mean? Yes. Okay. How about Jake? Oh, where do you show us Jake? What about this guy? Okay, go ahead. Who is his name? Bernie Butler. Pfft. What about Clark 
Nope. Okay. What about this guy? What's his name? <laughs> Stefan Brackney. I mean, we potentially could marry one of these guys if we really thought they were, like, good looking. I don't like that guy's nose. That's how I go husband shopping. Do I like their nose? No? Okay. I kind of like this guy, Clark. I don't like his voice, though. I don't know if I could deal with it. I don't know. We'll see. Does she have, like, a boyfriend here? We could go for Eddie Mullis. He does need a little bit of a makeover, but otherwise, he's cute. Oh, we got a gift in the mail. Okay. You want to give her a friendly introduction and give Eddie a friendly hug. I think we're going to be heading to the um, meet and greet soon. So I don't want to, like, get too much into doing something. And the next full moon is in seven days, so we don't have to worry about us getting messed up again. <laughs> this should be working on her charisma, I do believe. So that's good. She also needs to throw a protest at some point today. Um, but I am going to have her actually change into her outerwear because it's cold out, you know, it's, it's winter. Oh, she's going inside. Never mind. Guess she's met everyone here. No, she hasn't met this guy. I don't know why. I don't know why they haven't met, but she does need to meet him. Where's this guy at? I don't, I don't even know where he is at. Oh, here he is. Is somebody playing computer games or something? Because it seems really obnoxious. Oh, yeah, this guy, Bernie, is. Oh, it's starting to snow. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. I can't believe it's almost winter, like, in my real life. It's crazy. And I honestly, okay, so this is going to sound really crazy to you guys probably, but if you guys think about it, we are in, um, we're in August, right? So, we only have September, October, November, and December, and then we're literally on the month of Christmas. So there's really only four more full months before Christmas. So oh, freaking crazy, right? Like four to four and a half months pretty much before Christmas. So crazy. And where did this year go? I feel like it was just freaking January. Anyways, into the game. <laughs> I'm getting so distracted about where did the year go? It's been a crazy last year, okay? I'm just saying. I've had a lot of stuff happen. <laughs> a lot of good and bad stuff happen. So, hopefully, it'll only get better. You know what I'm saying? I love when you can, like, you, like, look back on saying something like this, and then it ends up being that it actually does get better, and you're like, aww, life goals. <laughs> Alright, so we're just going to start meeting all of the peeps around here because, you know, get that relation, those relationships up. Up, 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 up. Alright, I just want to get a bunch of new friends. What is this man doing? I honestly don't think they know. Alright, I don't see anyone upstairs, so it's all happening downstairs. But we're giving them friendly introductions so we automatically become friends. Is like life goals. Go ahead and greet that celebrity. Who is this? That's the mascot? Oh, heck no. He, he looks really cute. No offense, but he really, really does. 
Let's do this party invitation. It's a six. I'm going to say no thanks because we're going to actually throw a um, protest after this. I would have thought we would have met Waverly in the last uh, time we were here, but I guess not. I don't know. Who's the werewolf? Alfred? Hmm. I feel like we don't really know that many people here. I know how we can meet Ashley, so that's no problem. Oh, hello? Okay. Oh, we already know her, so I don't need to actually introduce myself to her. Just have to do a bunch of other ones. Alright, it's giving us more friends, though, so it's perfect. Jerry has quite a, the crazy hair, man. Alright, buddy. Mm. All right. Let's look at Jerry. I just want to see his face. Just real quick. All right. He's like the generic, you know. I hate going with the generic because then you get generic looking kids all the time. And I want like... You know, my kids look unique and stuff. So, I try to stick away from the generic looking people. Even knowing my sims probably always look generic, but I try. Alright, what's this person's name? Roderick Murphy? I want to see his picture. Hello. Hello? I think it's upstairs. Oh, okay. I was like, what is that noise? Alright. He is kind of cute. I could see it working. Alright, when you're done, I'm going to have you announce a protest. Hopefully you'll figure it out. And, it, and it'll work out well. <clears throat> so I think when she graduates, she gets another um, skill here. Or trait, I mean. I can't just I, I think she does. I can't really decide what I want to go for. All right. So we've only got like two more people to introduce ourselves to, and then we should be good to go. And we could blog about our new friend, but I don't think we need to. Did we sell our blog, by the way? Strebo. Mm -hmm. Where are you going? Don't go anywhere. Just go announce the protest. Forget about that. Alright, after you're done, ask for more donations. You can go ahead and um, ask for help, help with your academics. And then I do want to see if we sold your blog. You know how I can look without doing it like this. Go ahead and go in here. Number, total number of five star blogs written one. Um. Uh, I don't think we sold it because we've only got 1,079 on there. Alright, do this. And then we'll just announce it with our... Where is her thing? There it is. Go ahead and announce it. And I want to go ahead and look at her um, blog. Alright. Okay. We're going to go ahead and announce it here. Where we always do. And we're going to do standard for right now. I am going to do all of these at some time in the challenge. So we're going to do unskilled Tag. sims. Strebo. Romanu. Okay. We could... We can't sell it because we don't have a... Um, we don't have a buyout offer yet. I thought about when she had a new friend, it would give it to her, but I guess not. 
So try changing one relationship with somebody that we met today. We'll do Alfred and Kendallin. There she is. And we'll change them to be friends. And then we'll blog. That will work for me. 35. Alright, go ahead and do another one while you're waiting. Because we don't really have anything better to do right now besides work on this. Alright, we'll do Danny and you, Kendallin. Are going to be friends. And then we're going to blog about that as well. She does want to befriend Christy, whatever her name is. Kane, I think it is. So it's fine. 58 and 35. And we'll, blo we'll change another relationship to Jackie and Kendallin. Alright, and then we will blog about that as well. Might as well. Go ahead and post that. I'm going to let you eat an apple. And I don't think... Yeah, she's not going to have time to even eat the apple, so... That's fine. Alright, so we're going to go through this protest. And start off our week properly. Oh, someone's playing the guitar down here. Hopefully that doesn't bother. And I do have her in her outerwear so that if she gets cold, it won't be a problem. You wanted to give Ashley a friendly introduction, didn't you? Alright, before you start this, why don't you give her a friendly introduction since you can. And then lead chant, Ryle, speech, lead, Ryle, give, lead. Alright, that should get rid of that for you. That was Ryle, right? No, nope. lead Ryle. And I am going to ask you, ma'am, to go ahead and... Oh, I think, I think we're good. I think she's taking a break. Befriend Christy, eat a candy bar. We're not going to do that. 500 compared to what? No, we're not doing that. Oh my gosh. Fight a vampire. 150, 500, and 300. So I think what I'm going to have her do is befriend Chrissy Kane. And I'll just do it through the, ro the re um, relationship transmogrifier app. That way we don't have to really worry about it and it'll be done and over with. Okay. So just speeding her through this because we've seen it a hundred times. It's definitely really stormy today. So I'm sure it's, she's got to be getting pretty cold standing out there trying to do this. And it's still kind of early. It's about 8 o'clock in game. So I do want to make sure she gets to bed at a decent hour so she's not freezing to death. Impress Derek. Fight a vampire. We can impress Derek. That wouldn't be bad. It's definitely a success. Look at all those people down there. That's crazy. Alright. She is now a transsetter, which is awesome. And that's the top of the leader or the rebel group. Um, it sure as feels great for Kendall and Savage. She also made a name for herself in the artistic community. Artist community and the art appraisers would love to hire Kendallin. All right. Succeeding. And she's got a bunch of people, like, pretty much hitting on her and stuff. Which is whatever it is. We just need to give Eddie a friendly hug when we see him. I don't know if he's down here. I don't see him, but that doesn't mean he's not here. With them all in their, like, outerwear, they all look different anyways. Not, like, a lot different, but, like, different enough where it's hard for me to, like, tell. You know what I'm saying? 
I kind of can't wait to get home and like start the next part of this challenge. I feel like it's been so long for university, but it'll get shorter and shorter as we have to come back, which is fine with me. All right, it was a huge success. That is awesome. All right, go ahead and eat an apple, please. Girlfriend, you eating it? Yeah, I think she did. All right, go ahead and let's have you answer your phone. Because I'm tired of hearing it ring. We're going to apply for extra funds. Sure, we can talk with Samuel. It's only 11 o'clock. It's not too late. Is there anyone here that we haven't met? Charming introduction. I'll try and meet these people if I can. Just to have some more people. Alright, we already know her. And we know her. And we know her. And we know her. Okay. So I think we've pretty much met everybody. We got Betty Franklin, which we already know her as well. So I think we should be okay. Speed her up while she's on the phone. She'll be on this phone all night long if she could. Alright, get off the phone. I don't know what you and Samuel are talking about, but it is not that important. Alright, how about this lady? Oh, she's paparazzi. I don't care about her. Okay, so out of the three people that I told her to meet, she could only meet uh, Nicholas, which is fine. Nicholas, are you going to meet me or what, buddy? Because, like, I'm not going to be standing here all night trying to introduce myself to you. Okay. So now that she's done with that, I'm going to let her eat another apple, apply for extra funds, and then we're going to head home. So if we look at her schedule, her class schedule, she has class, two classes on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and two classes on Tuesday, Thursdays. Or one class on Tuesday, Thursdays, excuse me. So she has a class at 8 and 12 tomorrow, and then um, Tuesdays and Thursdays, it's at 4 in the afternoon. So it's not too bad. At least we can get it done pretty early in the mornings. So that's good. Okay. Let's get you over here. She wants to hang holiday lights. And you want to befriend Christy. So I'm going to try and do it through here. But I want you to ask for more donations. And I want you to ask for help with your academics. What is this? I don't care about receiving a text from him. No offense. And then I want you to do this. And if you are able to do that, we'll blog. You want to become good best friends with Samuel? We could probably do that for you speed you up while you're in here. She's probably not going to make too much money, but that's right. It's the start of the week. 2,547. So she's a little bit higher than like halfway, which is good. Alright, so we'll get her home. I We do need to blog about the new friendship. So before we do this, blog, then we'll try and change this friendship. And then we will try and blog about it again. If it ends up that, you know, we don't know this girl, this Christy Kane girl. If we don't know her, then we just obviously can't blog about it. But we'll try and meet up with her at some point to go ahead and situate the meeting, the meet and greet, pretty much, of Kendallin's life. And I've already grabbed gifts for the day, and um, that's fine. All right, so go ahead and finish all of this stuff. And then when you're done with all of that, I'm going to let you go ahead and sleep because it is really late. It's 2.30 in the morning. Way later than I really had hoped she would be up, but it's all right. She's an early day, so we can get some stuff done. Go ahead and post about your newfound friendship. And now we're looking for Christy Kane for the next part. I'm really hoping she's going to get a buyout option soon. All right, let's see. We're looking for Christy Kane. There she is. And you want to befriend her. So, Kendallin, there you are. Go ahead and make her our friend. There we go. All right, so when you get up, 
I will go ahead and I will let you um, blog or change yours and what's his faces Samuel's um, relationship. That should be fine. And then we'll use the bathroom because it's looking like you're gonna probably need it. So you go up a floor. Uh, I'll let you use this. I'm gonna tell you to eat an apple just because I can, just in case you need it, but I don't think you will. What is up with this clothes? I think I'm gonna have to change her bedtime outfit because it's kind of weird. But anyways, guys, that is going to do it. We are back at university now and starting on our last, very, very last week. We have four days of classes to get this maxed. And then Friday is our exams. Saturday will be our graduation. And then we head home to stay the rest of season one, pretty much, of the Ultimate Sim right there in Sunset Valley. So hopefully you guys are enjoying this. If you guys are, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. In the description below, Below, there is a donation link if you'd like to donate to the channel along with all of my social media links so definitely go ahead and check on those as well and um, I will talk to you guys in my very next episode thank you so much for watching